way before I was uh, trying to explain why I sold my Blackmagic Pocket Cinema camera. One of the reasons why I sold my BMPCC 4K was the fact that there was a possibility of a firmware update where you could use a GH6 to record an SSD. So in this video, I'm just gonna show you how to update your GH6 to firmware 2.2. It's a weird update process, so just stick around, stick with me to the end. Hello everybody, welcome back to my channel. If you're new to this channel, my name is Hakim and this is a platform that I use to share my opinions when it comes to anything tech, audio, especially video related. Today, it's a firmware update. Just a step-by-step -step how to video for the GH6. Firmware update 2.2 has a bunch of updates, but the biggest one for me is the fact that you can record on an SSD, just like the BMPCC 4K. But before we go to the update, one very important thing to note is this SD card, you need to run the update either using an SD card or one of the uh, CF Express Type B probably cards. Um, basically, um, just make sure that the SD card is goes through a formatting process in the camera. Don't format the card on the computer. Format the card in the camera. Put in the computer. We're gonna. I'm just gonna show you step by step on how to um, download the the firmware. You guess on the card. Put it back in the camera. We're gonna go that step by step. Go through that step by step. Put it back in the camera and do your update. Go in and type GH6 firmware. It's already showing anyway. Firmware update 2.2. Da, 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 da. You've already inserted your SD card, remember? So which one should I go to? There's so many options here. Mm, which one would it be? Is it this one? Um, is it? Yeah, you look for Panasonic Support Global SDC. Boom, you can't fail to find this online anyway. Am I in the right spot? There you go. 27 GH6 firmware days are da, da. There you go, September 27th. Uh, that's last week at the time I'm recording this video. Click to download page. Pops up this page, this weird page. Click here to proceed to the procedure of update download. Boom, opens another page. So they basically break it down for you, honestly, which is really good. They break it down because this, uh, this update, firmware update, is a weird one, it's different from the usual one. It comes like two updates, two firmware updates in one. That's what it is. So you see the instructions all the way to the bottom. You just go and click and use end user license agreement. Yes, accepted, unless you're not. There you go, it's downloading now. And so what we do is it takes, you know, a good few seconds um, or rather a few minutes for download. You see those two files right there? version 2.1, 2.2 um, firmware. So the instructions are really clear on the website, honestly, but we're gonna go step by step anyway. So these two files, all you have to do is just copy. Let's go to the SD card. As you see those files, you just paste, you just paste those suckers on there. So here we go. Once we're done, we've got the SD card from the uh, computer. We just go in, place in the SD card with the firmware on it. And then we switch on the camera. Switch it on, it's a manual lens on, just ignore that. Then we go to the menu and we look for the, actually that, yeah, this icon. So within the GH6 menu, you go to this icon. Um, that's like a, whatever that looks like. And then go all the way down to the bottom with the, that sub menu, sub something. And then go all the way down to firmware version. Firmware version. So we got two point Oh, and you just go with that option. Firmware update, boom. And it's gonna take some time. 
and it asks you update to 2.1 just say yes so you're just going to say yes and from 2.1 it will automatically go to 2.2 after doing the 2.1 just say yes and then boom just wait wait it out it takes longer so i'm going to connect the ssd so we can see if this t7 works oh my god i'm going to share my uh, rigging um ssd rigging um option that i came up with and now we're gonna go in and go to the menu the gear icon and then oh no you see we got uh version 2.2 .2 right there so that's confirmed so we go to gonna look for the ssd option there you go you got the SSD, USB off, you go, switch it on. So when you click on, it's going to ask you to format the drive. And you just go like, yes, format the damn thing. And there we go. Voila. So yeah, um, if you found this video helpful, make sure you like this video. Subscribe if you've not subscribed yet. If you have any questions down in the comments, I'm more than happy to answer your questions. And I'll see you in the next one.